Good afternoon. I hope you all had a wonderful weekend. And the weather definitely has been very generous to us. Weather looks like we are going to have another wonderful week of good weather. Okay, come back to the talk of how to make babies. I would like to share some questions which I come across with the patient they give to me. And the, probably we talk about many times, but uh, I would like to just uh, uh, remind our patients again, if somebody undergoing through IVF, the common question I always get is that how big of my follicle before I need to be triggered or I'm going to ovulate, I'm going to make go to quad X. So start from basic. If a lady have a menstrual cycle, at one point the follicle getting big and your estrogen level reach to the peak, that's the time usually mature, meaning that this egg is going to come out oblate. <coughs> so I usually in the natural cycle, the follicle size usually will grow around 16 to 25 millimeters, the diameters, okay? Estrogen level can go from 120 to 150. As a matter of fact, with increased age, estrogen level getting high can go from 160 to 190. So you will say, hey, the size could be 16 to 25 millimeters. It's a big range. Indeed, it's a big range. So how can we answer the question when patients ask me on a daily basis, hey, Dr. Zhang, how big my follicle should grow before you're going to trigger me? So the answer actually based on a few points. Number one, what's your estrogen level? If estrogen level getting very high, follicle may be a little bit small, we're going to trigger you. So it based on number one, your estrogen levels. Number two, if you was on the day 14 of your menstrual cycles, day 14, or let's say day 20, then maybe you'll be ready, even on a little bit of small size. What about its follicle? almost reach to 16 to 18 millimeter, but it's only day nine of your menstrual cycle. Then we maybe wait a little bit longer. And number three, it's age. So we always hear that a lady will say, you know what, my period was very long, even irregular, but since I reached to 42, 45, my period getting regular or even getting shorter. So Age is very important. So ladies tend to ovulate a little bit early in the more advanced maternal age, say more than 38 years older. <clears throat> so the age also determines when to trick. And number four was the natural cycle always medications. So if this cycle lady take a huge amount of drugs with lots of injections, then the cycle will grow a little bit bigger, longer, so follicle will get in big. If it was a complete natural cycle, usually without taking any medicine, usually, let you speaking, compare with themselves, lady tend to operate a little bit early, so follicle will be a little bit small. So in conclusion, for the doctor, at least in our center to determine at what size the right side to treat the patient for every retrieval, is based on size, yes, 16 to 25 millimeters. Number two, and this is number two size. Number one, what's the estrogen level? Number two, what's the extra size? Number three, how long has been growing the follicle? Day one, day nine, or day 14, or day 20? And then the age. More older, patient older, tend to follicle grow small. And last but not least, the natural cycle tend to be early, smaller follicle, take a medication, the size will be a little bit, uh, little bit longer, and follicle will grow more on the larger side. Okay, so this is not a simple question. You just say, oh, you, Mrs. Smith, your follicle will be 18 millimeter. You will be 19. It is an important size, but we also look at many things. Okay, I hope you got it. Estrogen level, age, what kind of cycles and what their cycles, day of the cycle, 
and exercise of the diameter of your leading point in determining what to choose. I hope you got it. If you still have a question, let us know.